What's up, guys? Knife Review, Grothman. Canadian made. Older company, I would imagine. And here's, here's my one knife I own by them. Nice, simple sheath. It falls out of the sheath. I don't know if they... They tried to make it obviously tight around the blade here, but it uh, it does fall out. So I added a loop knot to the little rivet they had here and into the back of the knife because they used to have a rope out of the back of the knife. And I don't like that because this is a small knife, smaller knife, and the rope would always be on my, on my fist, on my hand when I closed it. Added a uh, rope here for neck knife. Love it. Perfect. Monkey knot, uh, knot, so I can quickly uh, wrap it around my belt as opposed to my neck by just uh, whoop, dropping it using the rope as a rope. Obviously, you can put it through your belt. Not a big fan of that. It's not quick. It's not easy to take off. Take your belt off every time. So let's take the knife out. So the loop knot, basically slides on itself as you can see so as you release the knife the loop knot will undo itself and if you pull it hard and quick it just pops out and then the paracord is obviously getting some burn from that type of procedure on the knot but it is holding together quite well in the knife itself interesting shape it's like a fish, if I could describe it. I'm sure there's a more technical name for the blade. And I don't know it. And then the handle has got a very interesting notch here. It's actually quite comfortable. I don't know if I would ever buy one like this again, but I haven't disliked it. It was a gift, so I didn't make this choice. And then there's the loop, as you can see, is right in the way of the pinky. So if you have like a rope going through here, you feel it. Now, obviously, you can wrap that rope around your wrist and it would be safer to use, but I've never really had a problem using it. It's more comfortable this way. Full tang. Beautiful, big, beefy rivets there. It'd probably be nice to build a new handle for that eventually. Number one stainless steel. Rothman D.H. Russell. Whatever that means. Very sharp, stays sharp, Canadian made, not a spot of rust on it. Nice little ridges in the back for your thumb, carving purposes. Carves a point real quick, takes a big chunk out, too much of a chunk. As you can see, look at that thing. Yes, real nice, eats through that wet wood, it's not hardwood. Well, it might be hardwood, might be maple. Great knife, not too bad, I like it. Don't like the case. So as you can see, just a simple shake and there goes the knife. Not hardly any resistance in there, it's like shaking around in there. But good knife. And I fixed the case.